Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Lego Lee 29, and this is my last review. As a 14 year old, I scared you, didn't I? I'm turning 15 tomorrow, so that means it's my birthday, and uh, thank you for anybody who's wished me a happy birthday already. I've had a couple of people like, happy early birthday. Thank you, that's really awesome and really cool of you. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get on to this review of the Lego Cars um, set number 9483, Agent Major's Escape. It's ages 5 through 12, set number, I already said set number. Um, it has 144 pieces and retails for 15 US dollars. Here's a look at the box. Unfortunately, the box is really, really misleading because it almost looks like you get this nice little balcony design going on here. Uh, but you don't, which you know kind of sucks. Um, if you flip around the box, it just shows some of the basic play features that this set has. The set also features an instruction manual that has a few pages of building. Let's see, uh, 46 pages of building. So let's take a look at the cars included. First with this. car included with the set is Petrov Trunkov, I guess one of the women cars from the Cars 2 movie. He's exclusive character to this set, I believe, and he's a pretty cool little guy. He's got that nice minter, mintish green color. Little flick fire missile on the side here that you can just simply push and it will fire decently well. Some face printing, printing there, printing there, and I believe there's printing on the back. Yes, there is, with a license plate that says um, 1971 SMK. So he's a pretty cool little car. Um, nice design and nice to get a new character. Also included is a little bit different version of Agent Mater. He's got the normal Agent Mater uh, printing here, there, and on the sides and the back. But he has that very cool jetpack um, slash parachute thing that he uses in the movie. Very nice jetpack or whatever you want to call it here. It looks really cool. Nice flames coming off. And if you want to take it off, it's really simple just to take it off. Um, and then here, this is the nice parachute design. I really like the design going on here with the cool translucent plastic -ish thing. Unfortunately, I think this could have matched the color a little bit better. That would have been cool. He also has some Gatling guns on the side here. Um, if you push the Gatling guns in too far, his wheels actually won't turn, so that's a little bit of a problem. But still a very cool Finally, design. you get that little camera that's used in the movie that kills the cars. Very cool. Got a little thing on the side that says World Grand Prix, and that is a printed. Final this is a pretty cool, decent, fun Lego car set. I really like the little cars that you get with this set. Unfortunately, the box is a little bit misleading, and I pointed out some of the problems I have with it. And it's kind of, you don't really get anything big. You just get a couple of cars, $15, and like the other $15 sets that come with like a racetrack or something. This, you kind of only just get these little cars. But I still think it's a pretty good set, and I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. I'll see you guys next time, and I'll be 15 the next time I review a Lego set. Um, I'll see you guys then.